Hi friends, today we will see the lesson plan fungi from the unit plant kingdom. In the first sheet, the topic here is fungi from the unit plant kingdom. Instructional objectives, the pupil acquires the general knowledge about the characters of fungi. Describe the fungal cell structure, explain the economic importance of fungi, list out the harmful effects of fungi in plants and humans, differentiate between algae and fungi. Instructional resources, flashcard depicting the structure of fungi, rotating disc to show the harmful effects of fungi, chart showing the difference between algae and fungi. Previous knowledge, the teacher asks questions to the students to test their prior knowledge. Have you ever seen fungi growing on your spoiled food? Do you know how bread is baked? Where all can, can you find fungi? Does fungi belong to plants or animals? Have you heard about the fungal food that you include in your food? What is dandruff? Have you seen in your scalp? Give examples of food items that get easily spoiled. Now, uh, declaration of the topic fungi. Fungi belongs to Thallophyta. Plant body is not differentiated into root, stem and leaves. Define. The teacher defines fungi. The student observes to the fungi introduction. Evaluation. What is fungi? The plant body has filaments called hyphae. Network, network is called mycelium. Mycelium can be septate, cross wall seen or aseptate where there is no cross wall. When aseptate mycelium contain many nuclei, it is called as kinocytic mycelium. Explains The teacher explains the fungal body. The student follows the structure of fungi. What is the filament-like structure in fungi called as? Next, they have no chlorophyll. Fungi which have no chlorophyll are called as heterotrophs, which are of three types as saprophytes, parasites and symbionts. So here the teacher specifies the terms parasites, saprophytes and symbionts. Evaluation. Define saprophytes and symbionts. Listens. The student listens to the terms. Next, economic importance of fungi. Antibiotic. It is used as an antibiotic like penicillin, erythromycin, neomycin. And in foods like mushroom contains rich protein, example agaricus. Vitamins, vitamin B2 riboflavin is produced in alcohol production, in alcohol, sugar molasses in the presence of yeast, which act as an invertase, gives alcohol plus zymase. So here the teacher points out the economic importance of fungi and the student receives the economic importance of fungi. In evaluation, state the economic importance of fungi, we can write. Harmful effects of fungi in plants, example, Blast disease of paddy, tica disease in groundnut. In human diseases, we can uh, point out like ringworm, dandruff, and athlete's foot. States. The teacher differentiates states. Sorry, the teacher states the effects of fungi, and the student follows the harmful effects of fungi. Name the harmful fungal disease in humans. Next, differences between algae and fungi. Algae are autotrophs and as pigments, they are prokaryotic and their food is starch. Example, we get nostoc. Fungi are heterotrophs and they don't have any pigment. They are eukaryotic. The food is glycogen and oil. Example, agaricus. So here the teacher differentiates the characters of algae and fungi and the student analyzes the differences of algae and fungi. So differentiate algae and fungi with example is the evaluation part. Next, we have the recapitulation. We can uh, ask them to differentiate algae and fungi, describe the harmful effects of fungi, explain the fungal structure, state the economic importance of fungi, follow up activities, stick few pictures of fungal diseases in a chart, discuss the economic importance of fungi. So, and here ends the lesson plan.